Yo, 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 yo. You see your boy Nightcrawler Ray Ray, aka the Rooster, aka your old school junkie, aka Mr. Tony. Tony. <laughs> what it do, my peoples? My peoples, my outsiders. My outsiders. I'm about to keep saying, I'm about to remind myself to keep calling y'all my outsiders because, uh, you know, Tony Blob's outside. You know what I'm saying? And the people who support me are subscribed to the channel or, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. My outsiders, because we outside. We outside in the trucking game. And pretty soon we're going to be outside in the camping game and fishing game. Uh, don't forget the cars. That's what I want this channel to be about. Outside. Just doing stuff outside. As of right now, the freaking trucking game got me tied up. You know what I mean? But it's all good. Because, um, hey, that's my profession. I'm a professional truck. I'm a, I'm a professional driver. Professional driver. And I drive big rigs big rigs big rigs i drive big rigs i can drive 13 speed i can drive a 10 speed i can drive an 8 speed i can drive an automatic out of all of those i prefer the automatic because to me nothing climbs them hills like an automatic and you ain't gotta worry about down shifting or shifting gears and nothing like that but anyway, that's just that's just something to start to uh, start the conversation off with. But anyway, um, today is uh, February 9th, um, the day after my birthday. Um, those few people that got on here and um, wished me a happy birthday, I appreciate you. Um, peace and life to you guys. Um, safety and you know what I'm saying? If you're driving, pretty much, no, safety, period. <laughs> My bad. But yeah, um, yeah, thank you for um, wishing me a happy birthday, man. Um, I, I'm on my last load of my first full week with, um, with Nationwide and like I said before so far it's pretty decent I mean it ain't chart busted or nothing like that but I can see I'm keeping the brother paid and uh, I can see some consistency possibly uh, so yeah man but what I do want to do, I want to get out of this. They got another truck up there. That's a um, 2016 Freightliner, which is a 13 speed. Like I said, I prefer the automatic, but this particular one, I don't know, it's just calling my name, man. And I'm gonna see if I can switch out of that one, in a, out of this one, which is a 2020. It's a decent truck. Uh, it's got everything you want on it. Um, it's got the, um, it's got inverter, refrigerator, uh, a EPU, APU, whatever you want to call it. It's an EPU because it's, all, it's, it's, it's electricity, which I like a lot. I like the EPUs. But um, yeah, man, um, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to get in contact with the, um, with the owner. I done texted him like three or four times. To see if I can switch out and get into this um, 2016. Um, I don't. Know. I mean, I'm cool when 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 um when I'm on short terms. You know what I'm saying? And this and the, and this will be a short term. It'd be like a year's lease for this 16. So I can do a year standing on my ear. You know what I mean? So um, I think that that right there would be it's gonna be a wise business move 
It's a 2016. It's only got six, 600,000 miles on it. That's not bad. This one, shit, it's a 2020. And it's got 300,000 miles on it, so. Uh, it's a decent little truck, man. Um, it's a decent little truck. It's got everything you want on it, you know? Double buck, leather seats. Y'all can see back there. Got my Dallas Cowboy blanket. I am a big Cowboys fan. Big Sooner fan. Boomer Sooner. Uh, also like uh, the Trojans. USC Trojans. And uh, Cowboys and the Bucks are my uh, NFL teams. Cowboys is my heart. The Bucks is the is is a team that I like. Sooners. Oklahoma Sooners. It's my heart team, the USC Trojans. That's my uh, another team that I like. So I got two teams. I got two teams in football, college, and professional. And I have two teams in baseball. And that is uh, the Texas Rangers and the Houston Astros. I don't know if I don't know if either one of those are like a, a heart team or what. I just I like logos. I like the logos. I like the big T in Texas, you know. Of course, Tony. Uh, and then um, I like that um, that H with the star. You know what I'm saying? With the cat with the Texas star. I like that too. That's just me. That's what I like. But anyway, uh, like I said, this is my first full week with uh, with Nationwide. Uh, this this is my first full week. I grossed after I dropped this load today tonight in Pennsylvania. I have like a little over six grand for the gross. I mean. I don't have no truck payment until April, so I should be all right. Six grand is not where I would want to be, but in these times, I can understand. I'm still making some change. Uh, six grand. <laughs> I would have laughed at six grand a couple, shoot, last year when I was making 10 or 11 grand gross every week. I was booking my own loads. I was running with Landstar. Landstar, I have nothing bad to say about Landstar. Only thing is uh, that I didn't particularly like when it when things got rough as far as the market is concerned. Was I was confined to just one load board. Maybe I didn't dig deep enough to see if I could. Um, get on any other low board or use any other brokers or whatever like like that but um I asked one time and that was it they said no that was cool okay <laughs> that ain't why I left though should I left because that Mark as it is could, could you could say that's why I left because that one load board wouldn't feed me no more I left them in October. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Um, like I said, this is my last load of the week. I am in North, I'm in North Carolina. Where am I in North Carolina? I'm like pretty much right on the border of North Carolina and Virginia. Um, going to um, Pennsylvania it's like a 475 mile run uh, I'll be there today about 2.30 or 3 something like that my uh, delivery is not due until 3 a.m. I'm 
call and see if I can get a request going to Oklahoma City because I got to take care of some things. Um, my dogs is getting out of the fence. Uh, I might bring my dog, my female, back with me when I get on the truck this time. When I, when I come back. If I go to Oklahoma City, I come back and I'm going to get my dog put on the truck with me. She's a... Uh, matter of fact, she'll be one year... One, she'll be one on the 24th of this month. April of 24th of February. She's a uh, Belgian uh, Malinois. Her name is Rain. She's cool. Uh, right now, I'm getting ready to eat my breakfast. See that? See that? That's my breakfast for this morning. Kachava. Kachava's gonna, gonna, gonna uh, sponsor me one day, watch. Because I'm not no paid actor. And I'm promoting this stuff because it's good. It's all plant-based. See that? It's all plant-based. I don't know if y'all can read all of that, but just look it up. Kachava. Um, and I'm, I'm telling you just from my experience. You can pretty much mix this with anything. Milk, juice. I mixed it with the Arizona mango, which is one of my favorite juices out here. Arizona's gonna, gonna sponsor me too one day. Uh, but yeah, as far as juices goes, this is all over Hawaiian punch. Well, I, I, I say this ties with Hawaiian Punch because I like Hawaiian Punch too, but I drink this mainly. This Arizona um, Mucho Mango Fruit Cocktail. But anyway, I don't have a shaker, and this is what I use to drink my cachava. I use it. I drink water. I use it. I do it with water. I do three scoops. They say do two scoops, but I do three scoops in here and add water, shake it up. Oh my gosh, get a nice little drink. Y'all probably gonna laugh at me because I don't have a, uh, look, I don't have a, uh, I don't have a, a funnel either. Let's cut the top off, cut the, cut the um, water bottle. <laughs> cut a water bottle. Look at that, I got a funnel. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'm I'm just a driver, man. You know what I'm saying? And it's been a little rough these last couple of weeks, couple of months. So I gotta do what I gotta do, man. I mean, you know, shoot the resources, man. I can't spend no money on no that gun funnel. Uh uh. Or uh or shaker. Something like that. So you know, hey, Kachaba, if you guys want to send me a, a a a shaker and maybe a six or seven month supply of Kachaba, hey. Oh, oh, by the way, this stuff ain't cheap. So I got um, this is I got one more full. Um, I got one more full full package of this. This right here, I got the chai. It's pretty good. And I got one more. Let me see what else with the flavor that is. Yeah. The vanilla. I had vanilla, the chai. Yeah, these are the only two that I had. They're pretty good. Like I said, you can mix it. I mean, it. it Seriously, you can you can uh, mix this 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 right here with anything. I mean, I, I've never had a supplement that you can mix with anything, and it's good. 
I mean, you can, I mean, like I said, water. Some supplements you drink with water are horrible. But, um, but this right here, this right here, like I said, I do three scoops. I think I got two other videos that I did this on. But I'm going to do it one more time. Do three scoops, four scoops. Throw that joker in here. <clears throat> shake it up. I'll pat on it or whatever, and I'll shake it up. Pat on it. Empty it in there. And I'll be doing some big scoops too. Try not to be messy. See that? Bam. So I'm probably getting more than three scoops, but who cares? This is some good stuff, man. I promise you. It will change your it will change your bowel movement. Come on. So don't get don't get it wrong. It's not just strictly um <clears throat> for the bowels or whatever like that but it's good for them you never have you 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 would never have a better bm which is important too Some bitch. then you would have after you had a bowel movement with the chopper i mean flushes you out oh my god Gives you energy. I hadn't taken it in a while, but yesterday I had some. And it, uh, I felt like I had taken a B12 shot. So yeah, it's all natural and it's all plant-based. Plant-based. I can't emphasize that enough. Plant based, and pretty much, man, that's where everything is going to be on to be plant based because they done, they be pucking with the food, man. So, give me a water. Pull this water off in here. in here and all you really need is just one bottle I don't know if this is a little 12 ounce bottle or what what is it what size bottle is this I don't know man just a regular old water bottle uh, put the top back on and it's very important that you put the powder in powder in first and then put the water on top of the powder because sometimes you be drinking it and uh, if it's not shaking up good enough you will, uh, you have little chunks in there which is okay drink the chunks It'll hold you, man. It'll hold you for a while. Look that. Looks like a, pretty much like a, I don't know what it looks like, but, people 
drink stuff. They be talking about it and be, they drink it. They be, and it's real good too. They face be all, all messed up. Not this one. This is actually, I'm telling you, water. How many, just tell me, answer, answer this. How many supplements that's out there that you can really, that you can drink with water and say it's good? I'll wait. Comment in, in, in the comments. Let me know. But Kachava, I'm sold. I've been driving trucks for 12 years. I'm a real truck driver. Like I said, I am not bought and paid. I'm not sponsored by this. But it's my duty as a man and as a fellow truck driver. If I find something that's good for me, I'm going to pass it on. You know what I'm saying? That's just what I do. I am the servant's servant. Come on. But yeah, Kachava, man. I think I paid for one. $69. It could be cheaper than that. But I had, at the time, I had, I had like about four. Four, um, four bags. Five. Cause I think I still got a full bag at the house, so I got these. I got this half a bag and this full bag with me, the vanilla and the chai. But like I said, this is something that you can mix with anything. Juice. I mean, you don't, you don't want to be stupid and be like, I'm gonna mix it with some Dr Pepper. No, water. Juices, not you know, what I'm saying orange juice. I, I ain't never had it with no orange juice. I ain't never tried it with orange juice. I'm, I'm sure it's pretty good though. But I had it with some um, with with the, like I said, with the fruit juices, and with this um, with this Arizona um, mango, mucho mango. Heck yeah. And, and the mucho mango is fire by itself. But yeah. This is like my third video with this. And um and I'll tell you something. That's good. I think the second video that I made, the first matter of fact, the first video that I made with it, um, I had a fruit punch. And um, yeah, it's in my videos. Um, yeah, it was a fruit punch that I mixed with it. And it was real good. And then I did one when I was in, I took that trip to California. And I did one there. And now I'm doing this one here. But yeah, that Arizona, Arizona Mucho Mango. Fire, fire, fire. I like the Arizona teas too. The, the, uh, the sweet teas. And the, and the, and the green tea. Arizona sweet tea, green tea, and the mango, man, mucho mango. Yeah. All good. Put your water bottle. That rinse this out. But yeah, back when I was saying about um, about that truck, I need to get to Chicago, man, and and um, and talk with old boy, cause um, I really want to do that. I would rather have the the sixteen than the twenty, just for the simple fact it's a year's lease. <laughs> That's how I clean the bottle out, keep it fresh. Like I said, Kachava, if you guys want to send me a send me a um, a shaker and some more, um, if you just want to sponsor a brother, period, let me know. Contact me below. Hit me up, and I'm in like Flynn. That's how you keep the keep the bottle fresh.
Don't forget that this is your uh, this is your drinking bottle, not your pee bottle. <laughs> Which I don't have a pee bottle. I got a pee cup. And if um, you guys haven't done it yet, go to Pilot and get you one of the big 44 ounce um, plastic cups. I'll get you, get you a regular cup, a uh, styrofoam cup. Just set it aside, set it aside, and um, yeah, my load is ready. I didn't have, I didn't. I, my my appointment was, my appointment was at at nine thirty. Now the hazardous weather outlook for Central North Carolina. It's 8.40, I'm loaded. I got here, I think right at seven o'clock. And that's me, man. I try to do my stuff early. I try to do my stuff early, man. Get my stuff done early, man. out of your control and if, and if it's, it's if, I, if it's out of your control man don't even trip just go with the flow don't let nobody fuck over you but you know what I'm saying like this right here to me it don't make no sense to follow this yard dude around the yard to put a freaking uh what do you want me to do boss What the hell this nigga can be doing? Shoot! Follow him all around there. Man, it's unnecessary. Just keep a cool head. Just straight ahead like this. Just keep a cool head like this.
One thing I don't like about this, this truck, man, is this idle thing. Yeah, we loaded on our way to uh, Quakertown, PA. Let's see if I got this in. Already. We keep it raw and uncut over here. I try not to do a whole much editing because I don't know how to <laughs> I don't know how to edit too much. I mean I could speed it up and stuff like that. AM drive. Tell me, baby. Quaker Town, Pennsylvania. 336 miles. I can do that shit standing on my head. So, hey, so. This is how we do the fuel. So, it says 336 miles. So, what I'm going to do is do 350 miles so I can have a little extra fuel to get to my next stop. So, this is how you do your fuel. You do 350 miles divided by, you look and see what your miles per gallon is. I'm getting 
So just do seven. Well, yeah, I'll do six point nine. I keep it. I keep it exactly. Please right drive to highlighted route. And it tells me to put fifty gallons in. Now I'm going through the mountains. I know I'm going to go through some mountains, a couple of hills, and the weight on this thing is. It's not heavy. I got a full trailer of uh, Vans waffles. So. I want to say. I want to say it's about. Just find what the weight is, right? So, it's light though. It's twenty. So it's saying right here that the total weight on here is 20,000. So it should be alright. I'll go ahead and fill this one side up. Sometimes I don't even fill both sides of my tank, so I just use do one. Put some in the other one just to keep the dirt and stuff from floating around into my filter. But uh, 